Hey, what's up, Gira? And today I'll be showing you this new hammer build, and this time it's gonna be for the Blaze Emperor build uh, playlist. So, yeah, uh, without further ado, let's go right into the build. For the Omnisol, we got the Discipline Omnisol. I know, pretty rare Omnisol for me. Uh, next up, the hammer is gonna be the Magma Quake, which has double plus three in nine lives cells. Special is gonna be the Mighty Landbreaker, mod is gonna be the Extended Clip, and the Bond is gonna be the Infernal Burden. Next up, the Lantern is gonna be the Ember Rain's Rapture with plus three Catalyst. Helmet is gonna be the Dark Watch with plus three Rage. Torso is the Structure with plus three Pulse. Gauntlets are gonna be the time of gauntlets with plus three pulse, and lastly, legs are gonna be the time of legs with plus three rage. And as for tonics, we are using the frenzy, eight drive, and blitz tonics. So, yeah, this was the build, and now for the cosmetic side of the build. For the hammer, I went with the witch's promise. The lantern is gonna be the void beacon. Helmet is gonna be the paladin spirit. Next up, the torso is the infinite guard plate. Gauntlets are gonna be the Malevolent Twitch, and last but not least, the legs are gonna be the Determination. So yeah, that was built, and these are cells right here. But before we go to the cells and what the cells do, make sure to sub channel and like the video. We are currently on the road to hitting 2.5k subs for the end of the year. So yeah, let's try to get the that. Also, as much of viewers, are not subscribed to the channel, so if you do, I'd really appreciate that too. So yeah, now for the cells, we got the Plus 6 Catalyst, Plus 6 Cunning, Plus 6 Nine Lives, Plus 6 Pulse, Plus 6 Rage, and Plus 5 Aura Power. But if you get the bond uh, maxed out, you can get plus six overpower. So yeah, enough for test. We're gonna go into some kind of underground and test uh, this build out. For example, let's go to the let's go to the hated reach. Why not? So yeah, currently we're on level ten on the hammer, and the recommended level is level sixteen. Here we're gonna encounter the Hellion, Velomir, Razor and Karabek, Rockfall Scran, Bloodfire and Remain, and the Flamer Cool Shot. So yeah, mostly Fire Blaze Behemoth, but that's okay. So yeah, I'm playing hammer now. I'm not really used to playing with hammers, but we're gonna. You are best. And here we are on the Hades Reach. And let's see what the starting lineup is gonna be for today. Okay, we got triple place behemoth. We got the flame Bore cool shot, the Ember Rain, and the Helen. Okay, first let's go to the cool shot, and then we're gonna continue our way to those behemoth. With the hammers, you wanna do this before every fight to get your buffs going on, and then your tonics. There we go go and let's do that while we're here <laughs> okay it's gonna come out from here let's go and boom boom come on yep Ooh, that was nice that bro it hit me really i thought that that was gonna be a good dodge ah fuck okay i was pressing it but i guess it didn't do that okay we can Sagger it here. We do not die. <laughs> okay, come on. There we go, finally. By the way, uh, some news uh, came from the devs a uh, week ago or something like that. I, I can't really remember. They're playing to add a lot, of, a lot of things and they're like changing the forging system too. Basic, basically, they're going to add more behemoth to the game, uh, more variants. There was this cool one I saw, which was the Hellion one. It, it was like a kind of like a behemoth, kind of like a bone behemoth, which is really cool. I really like that. Also, they're adding this one. I mean, crazy feature. I don't know if anyone expected it, but uh, they're adding weapon changing. I mean, they were, you're gonna be able to change your weapon mid 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 battle. Crazy, right? Okay, let's try to do this. And yeah, there are also some like uh, videos here too. I'm gonna show you on the screen. Basically, the one is uh, where you change from chain blades to swords, and then and then and then another one is like you change from the hammer to the strikers, which is pretty cool. And yeah, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for those type of updates. I mean, all of those updates are gonna come. Uh, before summer 2024, in, not 2024, to summer 2025, 20, 20, which is next year. But I, but I hope they add some things uh, in the middle to keep things fresh, stuff like that. Okay, let's try to throw out this. Okay, couldn't really do that. Okay, we need to get our tonics. So yeah, uh, I think uh, there is, there's a bright future ahead of us for the Dauntless community and the Dauntless creators if they keep up giving us good updates and yeah I'm personally I'm personally looking forward to uh, still come on bro as I was saying I'm personally looking forward to the weapon changing thing update and also only behemoth and, and, and also only behemoth and 
some Behemoth reworks. There's also a new Behemoth, for example, like Ruaj, which was supposed to come out this year. I mean, like a month ago, but I think that got delayed a lot, so that's that. Come on, give me some... Interrupt, bro. Maybe Stagger. There we go, finally. Finally, thank you. Okay, let's go. Boom. And another one. There we go. Dodge this. Nice, nice. Let's plant this thing. Boom. Okay. Didn't do it, didn't do it, really? What? Okay. Yeah, that you can like change that with the strikers. She's gonna be really cool. Really looking forward to that. There we go, finally. Okay. Let's go break some parts. Boom, bro. What you talking about? And let's do that again. And maybe okay, we missed that. Okay, it's it's, it's, it's lagging, it's lagging. Let's heal up. Hey, what, bro, okay, what, what happened there? Okay, whatever. Bro, let me hit you. And, I mean, we interrupted it, but... At what cost? At what cost? Okay, and let's do that again. Come on. Sagar! Okay, we need to creep our tonics. Let's go. Nice, nicely done. It's gonna do that again. Of course. And come on. Yep, there we go. Nice, nice. Okay, it's going to rage mode, so I have to. Quickly move out of this way and it's doing the fireballs. Okay. Come on, bro. Why, why are you so far away? Again, it moved out. And we're on fire. No. Okay, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. Yep. Yep. Bro, come on. And there we go, finally. Okay, that was the Ember main. Next up, let's go to the Helen, which is oof, another one. So it's kind of behemoth. Okay, but, but before we go into the Helen, we're gonna drop our supply crate here. Let's do that to get our things back. And here we are with our favorite behemoth. Oh, I don't have... Shit. I don't have my ammo. Okay. Let's plant this. I don't have much time for that because... And it still got hit, really? Damn, okay. Bro! <laughs> and maybe... Okay, it did hit, but... Bro, really? Okay, I need, to, I need to focus, I need to focus. Come on, Sagar. Finally. Let's quickly do this so it's down. And we go again. And we do this again. No, it went away. Okay, where's it going? It's coming from here. Nice, nice, nice. We take those. And now we too. Okay, let's it let me just run away and you can do you. Okay. It's gonna go on the ground again, I think. Or not. Okay. No, bro, one health. Ooh. Okay. Nine lives came in clutch right there. We did 
Give me a can, bro. Come on, Sega. There we go. Don't know what happened there, but we take those. And... Come on. We got this, come on, we got this. We got this, we got in this bag. And there we go. That was the Hellion. Okay, do we have some time left? Okay, we do. Okay, let's continue to our next behemoth, which is, again, gonna be Flameball Cool Shot, which is level 18. So that's gonna be a good test for us. Okay, let's quickly. Oops, we need to. Okay, well, it's here and not underground. We're gonna do some damage. Maybe get some Sagar, come on. Okay, it ran away. But it gave us time so we can get our tonics back. And now it's going. So keep in mind we are using the fire b fire weapon and we are fighting against Blaze Behemoth, so it's gonna be a bit harder for us than if you're using maybe like an shock weapon. Or maybe like a Frost weapon. Well, Frost weapon would be nice against this kind of, this kind of behemoth, but whatever. We are using the place one because we we like that. We do it like that in on this channel. Ooh, that was a nice dodge. I thought that was, I was gonna get hit right there, but I guess not. And yeah, we are on, on, only level ten. And this guy's level eighteen. Keep in mind. I mean, I could have went to escalations and down like. I wouldn't say uh, really good, but better than this. Going to dodge this. Bro, come on, really? Oh, look at my health! Okay, as I was saying, I could have gone to the escalations and I could have done much better than this, but I mean, escalations aren't really good test, you know? Because you have like modifiers that give you more damage. You have more survivability, you take less damage. And yeah, it's not like really... Really that... How should I say this? Uh, it's like far from reality what you're using for the build, so yeah. Okay, here we are, he's doing this again. This time let's... Oh, bro! I saw it coming, guys. I really saw it coming. And... Right. I swear I pressed the dodge button, but it didn't work. It didn't work. Okay, now is our. I think. Do it in this go. Let's get our last batch of tonics. Okay, need to quickly do this. Uh, ooh, I thought I was gonna get hit right there. Okay, let's move out. And again. No, no, bro! I pressed the dodge button, man, I pressed it. And there we go, the... Finally, the Flamebor <laughs> Cool Shunt is down. Okay, so yeah, that was the Blaze Emperor build for the guys, for the Hammer players. So yeah, if you want any specific builds, you can comment You can comment down below, and I'll make them in the future. Like, if you want this build, but without any catalyst, I'll be... Glad to make that build for you guys. So yeah, this has been Gira, and I'll see you guys next one. Peace.